Greetings, fellow inhabitants of planet Earth. Imagine a tiny explorer, no bigger than a car, launched from Earth in 1977, Voyager 2. This little machine set out not just to visit our planetary neighbors, but to keep going, venturing into the uncharted territory beyond our solar system. For nearly half a century, Voyager 2 has sent us postcards from the cosmic frontier, traveling billions of kilometers, a testament to human ingenuity. When it launched, the world was a different place. No internet, personal computers were rare, and the idea of a spacecraft leaving the solar system was science fiction. Yet, with less computing power than a car key fob, Voyager 2 has outlasted its original mission, becoming our most distant emissary. Today Voyager 2 continues its lonely trek through interstellar space, a symbol of our relentless curiosity and desire to understand our place in the universe. Its journey is a story of exploration, discovery, and the enduring power of science to expand our perspective. The tale of Voyager 2 connects us all to the cosmos in a profound and inspiring way. Why launch Voyager 2 in 1977? Because of a rare planetary alignment that happens only once every 176 years. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune were all lined up, allowing NASA to use gravity assists, slingshot maneuvers, to visit each planet efficiently. Without this alignment reaching Neptune would have taken 30 years, with it just 12. Two spacecraft Voyager 1 and 2 were built for this grand tour, but only Voyager 2 would visit all four giants. Its mission to conduct the first close-up studies of Uranus and Neptune, worlds never before explored. Voyager 2 was equipped with cameras, spectrometers, and magnetometers, our robotic scientist in the outer solar system. The mission was a bold leap into the unknown, a once-in-a-lifetime chance for scientists to see all four outer planets. They built a machine to survive deep space, operate autonomously, and send discoveries back across billions of kilometers. The launch of Voyager 2 marked the beginning of a scientific saga that would rewrite our understanding of the solar system. In 1979, Voyager 2 reached Jupiter, the solar system's giant. It sent back stunning images of swirling clouds and the Great Red Spot, a centuries-old storm, larger than Earth. Voyager 2 discovered active volcanoes on Io, the first ever seen beyond Earth, revealing Io as the most geologically active body in the solar system. Europa's icy, cracked surface hinted at a hidden ocean beneath, raising the possibility of life. The probe also revealed Jupiter's faint, dusty rings and measured its powerful magnetic field and radiation belts. Voyager 2's flyby transformed points of light into dynamic worlds, inspiring future missions to explore these moons. After a successful encounter, Voyager 2 used Jupiter's gravity to slingshot toward Saturn. The adventure was just beginning. In August 1981, Voyager 2 arrived at Saturn, famous for its magnificent rings. The probe revealed the rings as thousands of individual ringlets with mysterious spokes, dark features that appeared and vanished. Voyager 2 discovered new moons, including shepherd moons, that keep the ring sharp and defined. It provided the first close-up images of Enceladus, hinting at recent geological activity, and studied Titan's thick, methane-rich atmosphere. Saturn's system was more dynamic and complex than imagined. A miniature solar system of its own. With another gravity assist, Voyager 2 set course for the distant, mysterious Uranus and Neptune. This extended journey was possible only because of the flawless performance of the spacecraft and its planners. As Saturn faded, Voyager 2 ventured into the cold, dark reaches of the solar system. In January 1986, Voyager 2 became the first and only spacecraft to visit Uranus. Uranus is unique. It rolls along its orbit, tilted on its side, creating bizarre seasons of 42 years of sunlight or darkness at each pole. The planet appeared bland, but subtle cloud bands and storms were detected, revealing hidden weather patterns. Voyager 2 discovered Uranus's magnetic field was both tilted and offset from the planet's center. The real surprises were among its moons, 10 new moons were found, and Miranda's surface was a chaotic patchwork of canyons and ridges, possibly from a catastrophic past. Voyager 2 also imaged Uranus's narrow dark rings, unlike any seen before. The flyby lasted only hours but revolutionized our understanding of this icy giant and its system. With another gravity assist, Voyager 2 set its sights on Neptune, the final planetary target. Each encounter revealed the unexpected, showing the diversity of worlds in our solar system. Voyager 2's discoveries at Uranus remain unmatched to this day. The journey pressed on, deeper into the unknown. 
In August 1989, Voyager 2 reached Neptune, the last giant. Neptune was a revelation, a dynamic stormy world with the great dark spot, a massive storm system, and the fastest winds in the solar system. Voyager 2 discovered Neptune's internal heat source, driving its wild weather despite the faint sunlight. The probe found six new moons but Triton stole the show, a frozen world with geysers erupting nitrogen gas and a surface scarred by a complex history. Triton became one of the few geologically active worlds known. Voyager 2's Neptune flyby was the grand finale of its planetary tour, turning distant points of light into vibrant, complex worlds. With a final gravity assist, Voyager 2 was flung out of the planetary plane, heading for interstellar space. Its planetary mission was over, but its journey was far from finished. Voyager 2 was now on course to become a true interstellar traveler. After Neptune, Voyager 2 began its interstellar mission, exploring the edge of our solar system. The sun's solar wind creates a vast bubble called the heliosphere, shielding us from deep space radiation. Scientists expected a smooth boundary but Voyager 2 found chaos. The edge was turbulent and complex. In November 2018, after 41 years and 18 billion kilometers, Voyager 2 crossed the heliopause, the boundary into interstellar space. Its instruments detected a sharp drop in solar wind and a rise in cosmic rays, confirming the crossing. Unlike Voyager 1, Voyager 2's plasma instrument was still working, providing the first direct measurements of interstellar plasma. The data revealed denser, colder plasma outside the bubble and a magnetic barrier at the edge. These discoveries gave us our first real look at the invisible boundary separating our solar home from the galaxy. Voyager 2's crossing was a milestone in human exploration. It continues to send back data, expanding our understanding of the space between the stars. The journey into the unknown goes on. Attached to Voyager 2 is the Golden Record, a 12-inch gold-plated copper disc, a message to any intelligent life that might find it. Curated by Carl Sagan's team, the record contains 115 images, sounds of Earth, greetings in 55 languages, and 90 minutes of music from around the world. It's a time capsule, images of people, animals, cities, and nature, sounds of wind, rain, and human technology, greetings from ancient Akkadian to modern dialects. The music spans Bach, Beethoven traditional songs, and Chuck Berry's Johnny B. Good, a playlist for the universe. The cover includes diagrams showing how to play the record and a map of our sun's location in the galaxy. The golden record is more than data. It's a symbol of hope, cre creativity, and our desire to connect across the cosmos. It says, we are a species that values science, art, and reaching for the stars. As 2025 ends, Voyager 2 is still going, a faint voice in the cosmic wilderness. Its power is fading, and soon it will fall silent, but its journey will continue for millions of years, drifting through the Milky Way. Voyager 2's legacy is immense. It transformed our understanding of the outer solar system and inspired new missions to follow its discoveries. Its images and data have shaped science and culture, reminding us of our place in the universe. Voyager 2 is more than a spacecraft. It's a story of human curiosity, ambition, and wonder. It connects us to the past, the future, and the cosmos itself. Voyager 2 embodies the best of humanity. Intelligence, creativity, perseverance, and the courage to explore. Its journey is a beacon, reminding us to keep questioning, keep exploring, and always look up. 